Greetings and welcome to Let's Play the Charnel House Trilogy. I'm pretty sure I mispronounced Charnel. I have no idea what a Charnel House is, but yeah! <laughs> I have also no idea what this game is about. Apparently it's a pretty good psychological horror themed game. And I kinda like these kind of games, so yeah. Yeah, I am in contact with the developer on Twitter. Well, contact. We tweeted at each other a few times, so nothing, nothing too serious, but um, uh, she, she asked me to tell her when I'm going to let's play this game, so yeah. I may be a little bit nicer than <laughs> knowing that the developer actually watches my let's play, but I'm, from what I've heard, there is no reason to be uh, cruel or mean to this game, since it's pretty good, apparently. I have no idea what it's about, so let's start. I guess inhale is the first one. I, I have no idea what the pulchre means, so yeah, let's inhale. So, it's another good evening to you, my fellow cheated hearts of New York City. Good news, the blizzard's finally stopped. But the weatherman says there's a rainstorm coming. Ooh. Just what we need, some good old fashioned New York rain. So close your windows, lock your doors, wrap up warm and settle in for another evening with me, Kenna Martin, exclusively here on BC 304 FM. I'll be taking you all through the night and right up to the graveyard shift, because who ever heard of employment laws, huh? So to kick things off with a personal favorite of mine, here's Forever by Nervous Test Pilot. <coughs> So apparently we are playing Isa from Killer Kill? Days ago. Ah, not really. <laughs> I ran out of excuses not to go and see him. I don't want to think about this. Good. Okay, left click interact, right click examine, double left click is uh, quick running. Up here is the inventory, yeah, looks good. So far I have to say I like the graphics. It's a little bit big on my screen, but I have to say when I see the preview window in OBS, it looks really snazzy. Very nice. Anyways, uh, oh, there's pot. something in amongst the fronds. I should get it free sometime. I have no idea what a front is. The pot plant. Oh, for twenty. Ah, Let's got it. Parcel I hadn't opened yet. Let's see. So you want to give up smoking? A self-help book by I Burn It. Kinda wish I hadn't found this now. I'll just put it back where it was. You have a parcel in your pot plant. Okay! That's what I don't really want to wear a coat indoors. Well check it out. Gavin's old coat. It's been here since since well, the night he left, I guess. My birthday. Classy guy. Mm. I do wish he'd come and pick the damn thing up though. Just burn it. That's what I would do. My adorable little pot plant. Gavin used to call him Dave. I called him Gilbert. Gilbert it is. Gilbert it is? Okay. A Books, bookcase. games, a couple of CDs, very me, and an asthma inhaler, for some reason. No idea who left it here. Might have been Sophia. Hope she has another. <laughs> Although since she hasn't been here for over a month, I guess she does. Oh, she's dead! <laughs> Sucks to be Sophia! Playing a game would be perfect about now. If only I could concentrate. Okay. Portal to an exciting other world. No. Or as the landlord calls it, the bathroom. My bathroom is a shower. Sure. the world. I could use a shower. Yeah, me too. No, really, I could really use a shower. Oh god. <laughs> what? Ten minutes? Are you wearing the same clothes? You shouldn't do that. <laughs> That's not so good. Okay, let's check the cabinet. She needs only ten minutes? Even I take longer! Well, shit. It's locked. I don't recall locking it. In fact, I don't recall it ever having a key. Well, that sucks. I have to strain between the... Don't feel like calling anyone, but I suppose I should listen to the messages. That may help. You have two new messages. Okay. First new message received today at 1.18 p.m. Congratulations. You have won tickets to the Krennic on Thames Museum's latest exhibit. Straight from the catacombs of Augur Peak, this is a once-in-a-lifetime chance to... Tickets to an English museum? 
Mrs. New York, kids. Not interested. Makes sense, eh? Message deleted. Second new message received today at 6.29 p.m. Hi, Alex. The nurse just told me you'd been in. Should have let me know. I'd have made sure I was here. It's been a while. I'm sure your dad appreciates it, love. You know he'd tell you that himself if he could. Call me on my cell when you get this. Goodbye. Love you. Bye. End of final message. I didn't call, Mom, because I knew you would be there, and I couldn't do it if you were. I don't know why. Please don't hate me. Okay. Uh, well. Screw it. I'll call her in the morning, right? Right. Pretty sure you won't. Nope. God damn it. <laughs> Talking to myself. My therapist says it's my desire for an audience, for company. What? I say it's because I constantly feel like I'm being watched. <laughs> Selfie. I, I, it's it's kind of what I feel. It's, it's, it's so harsh. <laughs> People. If I was drinking coffee or felt like reading, then maybe. But I don't, so no. Anything my on there? gave me this when I moved here. Gavin had to fix one of the legs a few months ago. Oh god, never mind. It houses a bunch of old games magazines, last Tuesday's copy of the paper, and an ashtray. What a life. Yeah, that's a life. I have a strange feeling that Gavin is the ex-boyfriend. I may not be so sure the game hasn't hammered it in yet. <laughs> Enough, so. I'm pretty hungry, but I'll grab dinner in a bit. Got things to do first. The kitchen. I'm not actually a bad cook. I just usually can't be bothered. That's just like me. This is the female version of me. She talks to herself to an invisible audience. She can't. She can cook, but uh, can't be bothered. I, can you not? Uh, it it kind of hits home. <laughs> the snow oh, might have stopped, but it's still utterly freezing. I'll pass. Thanks. A surprisingly beautiful view of the city. One of my favorite things about this apartment. It's dark out. Well. Ooh, talkie! While I've always been tempted to put it in the microwave, I think I'll leave it here for now. Don't put the doggy in the microwave. To the little guy. I call him Sam. Aww. Elemento. Gavin won this for me in one of those claw machines. No idea how he did it. Some kind of wizardry. I put my I put on my wizard hat and wizard robes. I know. Uh, I'm sure it's here for a reason. Yeah. Mm, just my scribblings. Can barely even read it. Mm, just my. Great, great. Uh, tower, the tower of power. You shouldn't put your tower on your desk because of the vibrations. Uh. Power on. Good idea. Yeah. Five minutes later. Okay, what kind of... Aww. Oh, scribbled out face. I'm pretty sure that's Gavin. I may be wrong. Nope, not changing it. Let me have this one childish act of rebellion. Okay. A photo of Gavin with his face scribbled out. Hey, a, a girl's entitled to the occasional petty, vindictive outburst, okay? Sure. I'm not changing it. I kind of like bitter reminders. You are strange. It's a photo of me. With my friends Sophia, Isaiah, and Carly. And that asshole's there too. It was taken on my birthday a few months ago. Oh, well, he, uh, apparently, uh, yeah, uh, thing and stuff. Um, can I do something with the desktop? It's a photo of me. Yeah, yeah, I, I know, I know. Can use right. the keyboard. Let's do this. Let's do this! I have no idea what, but we're doing something. Oh, look. Drama, as my favorite reviewer, gives a game a low score. Whatever. I've always loved his writing. Very personable. Makes me feel like I know the guy. <laughs> Usually they give oh, better well. reviews. No time for that now. Gotta track my package. It has to be here today. Let's track the package. Of course. I had to change all my regular passwords. Gavin knew them. God damn it. What did I use here? <sighs> I think I wrote it down somewhere when I was drunk. Oh, yeah. Uh, can we just use the password reset options? Ah, here it is. I think. Okay. Broom. Post-it note to... The writer walks the shores where love inscribed its final kiss. Time to read, Alex. Really? 
Nah. Really? Nah. Nah. The writer walks the shores where love inscribed its final kiss. Time. I guess you have to check the bookshelf. <laughs> yeah, I, I always uh, save my passwords and whittles. That's kind of a hobby of mine. I mean, going all moose about this. Let's do this then. Okay, the writer. Nah, let's not get sidetracked with minor things like asthma. Yeah, who cares about it? Atlas Schwacht. Okay, that's a heavy book. The Mirror by Graham Masterson. I remember this being pretty terrifying when I was a teenager. I wonder if it'd hold up. Sanctum by Madeline Rue. This just came out. I have an especially strong connection to her writing. I can't wait to read it. In fact, everyone should. Yeah. Yeah. Fifty Great Coastal Walks in the British Isles, Volume Two. I checked this out of the library years ago, then forgot to return it. Don't ask me why. I've never even been to Britain. Hopefully the librarian's forgotten. Sanctum by Madeline Rue. This just came out. I have an especially strong connection to her writing. I can't wait to read it. In fact, everyone should. Yeah. No, no, no. The, the creator of this game is, is not Madeline Rue. No, I'm pretty sure about it. I'm bad with names! Shut up! Reading Megalopolis by Gail Simone. I bought this because I loved her run on Secret Six, but I haven't had a chance to read it yet. Ayn Rand's Atlas Shrugged, a beautiful novel by an author whose beliefs I totally agree with. Just kidding. Rand was a fucking troll. <laughs> I only bought this thing because of Bioshock. Oh, okay, makes sense. Death, The High Cost of Living, just one of my many Neil Gaiman books. All the onk-wearing wannabe teenage goth girls in the world can't kill my love of the endless. Also, who am I kidding? I was totally an onk wearing wannabe teenage goth girl. I have to say, for you still are. Special Topics in Calamity Physics by Marisha Pessel. The only time I've wanted to slap and hug the main character at once. Good book. This is thing I can't. I, I have no idea who the. Well, I, I heard of Atlas Schwacht. I heard about it, I never read it. But the, the only books I've read are still like the Lot of the Wings trilogy. And of course the Warhammer 40k uh, 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 Horus Heresy first nine books novels. <laughs> oh, sells the Charnel House Burial, my prized first edition copy, the one memento from Gavin I'll never get rid of. Okay. Nah. 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 Okay. The writer walks the shores where love inscribed its final kiss. The writer walks the shores. Louis Cassell's The Charnel House. The one. No. Special topics in calamity. The only. No. Death. The high cost of living. Just one of my many. All the onk wearing wannabe teens. I guess no. Leaving Megalop. I bought this because I loved her run on Secret Six. But she hasn't read this yet. Great Coastal Walks of the British Isles, Volume oh. Two. I checked this out of the library. Year. I've never even. I've just been feeling that's it. Can't face the shame of seeing the due date. I can't. Fifty Great Coastal Walks of the British Isles, Volume Two. I checked this. I've never even been to Britain. The writer walks the. Sh Writer walks the shores. Fifty great coastal walks. I check. I've that makes sense. No. This just came out. In fact, everyone. Nah. I'm saving it for us. I haven't thought about this book in years. I doubt it's the. By applying the principles of objectivism to this, I can discern it isn't the book I'm after. Okay. I've no idea what it I'd just said. I'd love to sit down and read this. As shown in Horowitz's 2003 essay, "This is the wrong book." This is the wrong. Okay. Oh, Cassell. You are a strange and troubled man. I wonder whatever happened to you. For your graduation. I hope there will always be room in your spectacular mind for me. You are my island. Love you forever and always, Gavin. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, I get it. Cassell famously became a hermit while writing this book. The island he moved to was called Augur Peak. I remember now. Augur Peak 1318. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, well, it makes it if, if you're that kind of person, it makes sense to do this. So, 
better than hey I, I hit it into a sliding puzzle box or something. I resent having to pay special delivery for train tickets, but I need them today. The next train is in for two weeks. I can't wait that long. What? What kind of train that only once every two weeks? Password protected. The site says it was delivered and signed for. Okay. I don't recognize that signature, and even I would have remembered signing for it today. It looks like it says Benwood or something? What? Well, great. Fucking perfect. I need those tickets. Maybe it's a mistake. Maybe they'll still come. Maybe the website's fucked. Well, what if your neighbor is called Benwood? Now. What else can I do but wait? Oh, hi. Now it's storming. This is gonna be did, fun making my way to the station by midnight. Did, did somebody see that? I'm not being Don't sarcastic. There? I just want the tickets to get here. Guess I'd better find a way to spend my evening then. Not, not on the couch if possible. Like a game, so maybe a DVD is in order. Might make a change. No, 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 no don't sit on the. There was something on the. Side, it seems like the storms hit a little so early in New York. Rain, thunder, lightning, the works. So batten down those hatches and get ready for a cozy musical night in with me, Ken and Martin. I've got no desire to. Okay. Uh, we checked all of these. Hmm. It can't be locked. It doesn't even have a keyhole. Uh, it must be jammed. Mm, I think I can jimmy jam. it open with something. If I can find something that'll fit. Oh, a knife? Unfortunately, Gavin took all the cutlery with him. So I'm having to make do with brittle plastic crap. Well, that's not good. won't be any good. use. The more I think about that, the more it pisses me off. Who takes the fucking forks when they go? Seriously. Yeah, what an asshole. There's nothing useful in there. Unfortunately, it won't be... If I was drinking coffee, but... Sure, yeah, I'll go to bed at 7 in the evening. That'd be suitably pathetic. I sometimes fall asleep at 7 in the evening after work. Ah! Thanks! <laughs> God, this game hates me already. There's something behind the radiator. Maybe I can reach it. Yeah, There's reach something... it. And do it. Ah, got it. A parcel I hadn't opened yet. Let's see. A DVD of Strangers on a Train. I bought this for Gavin. Ugh. Ugh. Back behind the radiator it goes. Why would you put it back? You are strange person. might have stopped, but it's still utterly freezing. I'll pass, thanks. Okay. Okay, let's see. I should leave the plant alone now. No. My adorable little pot plant, Gilbert. I don't... Gavin's old coat. Well, the night he left, I got. I do wish he'd come and pick. Ah, the sofa. So many happy memories of sitting here doing fuck all. I have nothing but love for this sofa. Wait, no, the other thing. Uh, apathy. It's a sofa. Actually, it's a bed too. telling me I need a vacation. I'd prefer to leave it on. I like the ambiance. Nah, I would go crazy with that. Trusty portable radio. These days, it gets a lot of use. Then again, I have YouTube running all the time, so who I am to talk, eh? I guess I can't use the inhaler to jimmy the lock. Let's knock it side. I have. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, nothing here. Jimmy it with the post-it note. Do it! Oh come on! If you if you really wanted to, you could. I'm not calling her or anyone else. Not tonight. Not tonight. My DVD collection. I think a few of these are his. I should. No, I don't do it. My DVD. I... Okay, you wanted to watch DVD, so what? Uh, what? What's your problem? What, what's holding you up, lady? That's what YouTube videos. That's what, can you watch cat videos? I've already read it twice because that's how exciting my life is. Some games magazine. Every review score is seven or above. <laughs> you know what? I think this little guy's tail would fit in the gap. This DVD? idea is so stupid that it might just work. Okay. Well, let's use the doggy. Aww, doggy. Here goes. It fits.
fits perfectly. Aw, oh, shit. The tail's just stuck. Aww. Well, this was one of my better ideas, wasn't it? Fuck's sake. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> fits perfectly. Anyways, it's safe. And of part one. I have this strange feeling I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this game. Anyways, I thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and we will see each other soon. So take care and hit the like button.